round four as the Canadian cricket team is finally off for a pre-tournament training camp in Dubai. They're headed out tonight and then they'll be heading to Bangladesh where the first match of the Cricket World Cup 2011 will kick off on February 19th. Nita Kosa was at Pearson Airport this evening to see the team off and she filed this report just a few minutes ago. Hi Angie, I'm here at Terminal 1 at Pearson International and some of the players and staff members of the Canadian team have just arrived and getting ready to check in as you can see behind me here and they all tell me that they're very pumped up. That's because for many of these players, this is the first time they'll be competing at the World Cup. Yeah, World Cup is a great stage for any player and it's a really good opportunity for a young youngster at being this age at age 20. It's no one really gets it and I'm pretty excited about it. It's one of the dreams come true. Actually, I played a long cricket in Canada as well when I was 16 or 17. But there is some disappointing news. Three of the players that were meant to fly out tonight were not granted their visas to the UAE. But Cricket Canada officials tell us that the International Cricket Council has assured them that they will have their visas by this Friday. Meanwhile, the three players of Pakistani origin that we reported about last week have still not got their visa entry to India, which is one of the host countries of the tournament. Uh, yeah, like uh, it's um, three three players didn't get uh, on time actually, so they left back. Uh, they'll be only joining us on on Friday. And Andy, cricket officials tell me that the team's captain Ashish Bagai will not be accompanying his team tonight due to medical treatment that he received just this morning for an injured knee, and he's being advised against traveling for the next 72 hours. But he will be joining the team by this weekend. And I'll have a more detailed report for you tomorrow on the team's itinerary, as well as an update on the visa issue for the three Pakistan-born players. Back to you, Angie. Okay, so do tune in tomorrow night for Neetu's updated report on the cricket team. That was Neetu Kosa reporting to us from Pearson International Airport.